No, I don't care. I don't care. We're gonna play sick. We're gonna play so good. It's gonna be stupid. We're jumping right into the action. We got the Vancouver Canucks who are 13, 11, and 4. Hopefully we simulate well and hopefully I actually do play all right. Okay, that's a hot start. 11 shots, two goals. Mm-hmm. Okay, so about that. Yeah, don't think we're playing too hot, actually. I take it back. Maintain a 935 save percentage over the next three games in your dreams. San Jose struggling. 7, 18, and 5. Come on, this has got to be the one. Okay, okay, all right. Very solid second period. Let's go ahead and hop in. I suppose we can maybe get a W here. Certainly no promises, but it would be nice. Great giveaway. They gave it to Theodore immediately. And now we're in on the attack. I actually really like these San Jose jerseys. I can't lie. They are beautiful. I didn't even know, but apparently there's new reverse retro jerseys. I saw the Montreal ones and they were blue. And I was kind of on board with it. I think they looked pretty cool. So yeah, I need to go check out some of the other ones. But that's probably very old news when this is coming out. See, this is why I don't talk about hockey news in my Pia Pros. Because it's, it's always so far behind that it's irrelevant by the time I'm actually talking about it. Timo, thank you for the save. Pass that out to Shea. Blocker save. It's a pop fly. Dropped a butterfly. And we managed to get it to the corner. Back to the point it goes. Mackenzie Weger. He's walking in to Ennis. <laughs> if that bounced and went five hole, I would not have been surprised. Still would have been pissed off though. I would have been fuming. Big draw win needed here. Otherwise, they are going to keep up this attack. Nice. Get it out of the zone, please. It's your only task right now. boy, Chandler. We're going to chalk that first game up to a fluke. And the rest of the video, we're just going to be insane. It's actually going to be illegal how good we are. Eklund is in over the line. Goes for a pass in the middle. But the defense had other plans. Not letting him do that. LeBanc goes over. I probably should have been scored on there. I'm not going to lie. I refuse to accept the possibility of us not making the playoffs. It's still very early in the season. So I'm not jumping any conclusions here. But I'm just saying. I refuse to see that as a possibility. We have to make the playoffs. That's a save, and I dropped a butterfly to make sure that it wasn't about to be poked five hole. No dice. We're still up by one here, and they've gotten a few chances. Nothing too scary yet. I'm also going to give our team props for our effort in the faceoff dot. I don't think I've seen us lose a faceoff yet. We've been on fire in that category, so keep that up. It's always good to win draws, get possession. And here is Couture. He's in. I knew he was going to go there. Blockered it. And once again, it's a pop fly. Petrangelo breaks up in front of the net. Headmans it to Hartman. Now here come the Golden Knights. In over the blue line. Let's go. Let's set something up here. Yeah, sure. That works. That was terrifying. <laughs> oh my goodness. I didn't even want to say anything. I was too busy focusing. Because they started to chase me. Big hit. From behind the net. And then some guy tried to step up in front of the net. It's almost like they had a, a pre-game meeting scouting out. Yeah, this goalie likes to come out and play the puck, so just pressure him. Easy goal. And they executed on their game plan. Unfortunately for them, did not result in a goal, but that is very fortunate for me. Ooh, that was a close one. Good shot. But the goalie managed to just react on time. Another big save. All right, we're getting some nice chances here. It would be super cool of you guys to get another goal and give us the insurance marker. But I can't be upset with how you're playing right now. Their goalie is just keeping it out. Really? Really? It's a good goal. It's a good goal. Not rattled at all. Nope. Nothing about me is upset. <laughs> Couldn't be happier. Actually, thanks for asking. Mackenzie Weger goes behind the net. And that will be picked up by McNabb. Who loses it, kind of. But Marcheseau makes quite the maneuver there to get it. Nate Mack. All right, guys. Are we trying or no? Apparently I didn't get the memo because we had a clear opportunity for a good shot in the slot and did not take it. Not too sure about that choice. No! We're headed to the PK. Nate Mack takes a tripping penalty. That is not good. We once again won the draw, but this time we failed to get it out. The Sharks did it for us. Thanks, guys. That was also terrifying, but it worked. I didn't realize that there was only a minute left already as well. I thought for some reason that we were only halfway through the period. But no, we are very far into this third. And that's okay by me. If we get to overtime, it's just a guaranteed point. So I'm super down for that. I don't think we're going to have the 935 save percentage. Can't recall how many shots they had coming into this period. But I don't think it was that many, you know? What's going on here, guys? Please? Yep. 
You're doing well. All right. All right. If they score here, <laughs> I'm going to be very upset with you. Eklund, he got the other one, I believe, and he's looking to get another to get his team the dub. He faked me out so hard. He faked the pass, pretended like he was going to shoot, and then passed it, and I got wrecked. All right. Fair play. That's an L. Those two games were just flukes. It's fine. We're going to play outstanding the rest of the games. We just need like a 60 safe shutout to get that 935 goal. But I don't care about achieving those goals anyway. Coach isn't doing anything about it. He's not punishing. So it doesn't matter. You know, we can not meet expectations all we want apparently and get away with it. Our record is 16, 12, and 3. 17. Let's go, Robin. The Jets are 20, 14, and 0. And we get scored on once in the first period. But that was on 17 shots. Please. Please have a good third period. I knew it. I literally knew it. But they do have 41 shots. And we're headed to a shootout. All right. Phenomenal. How will we do against the Broad Street Bullies, you may ask? Great question. Let's find out. One. One. After. One. It's okay. It's always the third period that we melt down. Yeah, that's fine. Two, two. And here we go. Let the explosion begin. Yeah, we still have that sponge X Factor challenge on the go as well. And we need an 890 save percentage and a shutout by the end of the year. It sounds very easy, right? Nope. I assure you, it is not. The 19th placed New York Rangers. We're in again. Let's see how we do this time. That's a good start. Second period. All right. <laughs> it's going to happen. How bad is it? Yep. All right, this game is so predictable. Like, for once, can we just blow up in the first period and get it over with? Holy smokes. Zeros, 2-1. I could jump into this one. Ah, whatever. Okay, we actually did all right in the third period that time. Nathaniel playing his former team. It's a 1-1 game in the third period. Let's see if Nate will be able to triumph over his old team or if I blow it for him and we get lit up. <laughs> That's probably... The two opportunities here. The two things that will happen. Oh no. Oh no. They have the puck in the slot. It's terrifying. Landeskog gets tied up. Kicks it to Newhook who loses it. Shea Theodore's right there to pick it up. Here we go. Knights. Over the line. You got Nate. You got Nate. Nice try. I like the effort. I once again want to encourage you guys to try a goalie be a pro on your own. I don't know if it's just me that struggles. But I've heard other people saying that it's extremely difficult. So it makes me feel a little bit better anyway. Eichel, cuts in the middle. What a shot, great save on the blocker. Billy Huso out here stealing the show right now in this third period. He's playing very good, made a few very nice saves. I swear these Be A Pro teams feel like they're fantasy drafted. Like players are just all over the place, but I'm actually, I like it. I'm totally on board. Dadanov's got it. He's able to walk in, tries to go short side and we blocker it to the corner. Battle ensues, and we emerge victorious. Hartman going to get rocked at the bench. Gives it up, and now Devin Taves coming in. He does a little toe drag, but Petrangelo decides that he is going to steal that puck from him. We literally just had three straight face-offs. Like, I'm talking two seconds apart from each other. Landis Cog leading the charge here. Gets it over to Byram. Oh, ho, ho, ho. that was close. Back to the point it goes. And Kane, I kind of forgot we had Kane. I feel like I haven't seen him at all in this matchup. But hopefully that changes here. Nice try, Nate. Let's go! What a play. Battle in the corner. Behind the net she goes. And that puck will be buried off of a centering pass. Goalie didn't get over in time. At least I think that's what happened. Oh, we actually got a replay. Yeah, he kind of did get over in time, but just lifted it over the left mini wheat. And that will put the Golden Knights up by one. Splendid. That's a great way to have this third period wind down. We're definitely not safe, but the good thing is that if they score now, we're not down by one. We're just going to be tied. So that definitely puts me at ease at least a little bit. Maybe not a lot, but a little bit. Kale McCarr point shot. Whoa. Whoa. Why did I slide so far there? I feel like I didn't do that, but maybe I did and just didn't realize I was doing it. Eichel takes it off of Makar. Goes for a pass back to the point, but nobody's home except for Vinny. He's in now. I'm watching the center guy. Is he going to go for the... Oh, that's quite the battle you got there. Oh no, ranting in, in the slot. Save that and definitely smother it. I'm not trying to give them any chances here. The clock has been moving seemingly pretty quick because, again, I thought there was a lot more time left than there is. We are down to the final two minutes 
about to hit the two minute warning here. And as you saw, we did get the one goal lead. Makar takes a shot that will be saved. I'm gonna do it. I don't know why I did that. Everything in my head was telling me not to do it. And I still decided, hey, this can't go wrong, right? Final minute of play. The question is, do the AI pull their goalie? Like, oh, they do. For some reason, it's just our team that refuses to pull the goalie. That has to be some sort of bug because there's no way that, hmm, that scared me. <laughs> Nice save. Yeah, there's... Ah! Oh my goodness! Holy crap! <laughs> I feel like I just saw a ghost. That scared the crap out of me. The guy was coming in. Oh, I should have smothered it. If this is a goal, it's mostly on me. No. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. 16 seconds. Can we get a clutch draw? No, we can't. Byram has it. Smother... Please, get it out of our zone right now. TJ is panicking far too hard. Beautiful. Chandler here from State Farm just getting us our insurance marker. So we actually got a dub. Save on Dadanov at the end there. What a performance from the Golden Knights. There we go. Now we're talking. 34 saves and one goal against. That's going to help our 935. Or is that already done? That might already be done. Now that's a good sim. 6-1-W over the Ducks who had 32 shots. And we just made a promise to Hatrick Kane that we'd be a top three star. There's no way we didn't get a top three start with that. That would be an absolute joke. They did get six goals, but I mean, come on. Let's see. Promise success, right? Or not. What is going on? How? How? That has to be a joke. Yup. He was spitting facts. We are on a five-game winning streak, and they're putting me in against the Ottawa Senators. Risky business. Let's see if it pays off. First period will be a 1-1 hockey game. 3-2? That's still anybody's game at this point. The Senators actually started this period on the power play as well. Did not notice that during the simulation. But it's okay. We can kill this off. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy for your Golden Knights. Kachuk almost put himself offside. And now we have a two-on-one shorthanded. Hartman. He just got his career ended. Steer it aside. Just a classic hockey save. Jimmy Superstar gets it to Shabbat. Oh, I'm very happy you intercepted that. He was winding up, and that was below the hashies as well. Shabbat keeps it in, Patherson. Ooh, he almost had a very, very deadly chance there. Might have gotten over in time with that slide, but it still would have been a scary shot nonetheless. Could have found its way in. And now Drake has it behind that. End to end? You won't. No balls. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, what a pass! <laughs> Thankfully, it was offside. Pretty sure the challenge we just got was to allow a max of six goals in our next three games. And considering we let three in in this one so far, okay, there could be more. I like that's going to be very difficult to achieve. Very good scoring chance there for the Golden Knights. But Forsberg going to keep his team up by one. Slap shot from Cogliano. And he gets his own rebound. That guy's so fast. Back to Zadorov. It is blocked by Nate Mack. And we managed to get it out of our zone. Good stuff. I see we've been working on that. Clearly. So we've been doing much better in that department. Oh yeah? Oh yeah? Nate to the net? The fact that that almost worked annoys me. It shouldn't have. Formanton to Thompson. And please be there for the rebound. Thank you, Shay. If I looked at how many shots they had coming into this period, I don't remember what it was. Big hit. Right in front of our bench, Jimmy Superstar tries to pretty much pass it right through Petrangelo, who stops him with ease. And now, we're back on the attack. Nice try. Shot it into a crowd, though. Was not able to find its way through. Hartman on the back check. Jimmy almost gets a shot off, but no dice. How do you miss that? How do you miss that? That was a free net. The freest net I've ever seen in my life. Like, that was... A road hockey net at the end of someone's driveway with a big piece of paper saying free. And you missed it. We need a goal here soon. Time is running out. And we are still down by one. It's been a goaltender's duel in this third period. We've both been playing quite well. But there have certainly been a fair amount of chances for the offense. I guess that would mean that we are playing well. You know, if they weren't getting a lot of chances, then maybe we didn't let any goals. But it doesn't mean we're playing good. So, yeah, that does check out. There's a shot. Probably shouldn't have passed that either. But hey, I haven't <laughs> paid for it once yet. So, 
There's a receipt coming. I just don't know when. Nice try. No, so close. That's the first time I've seen the desperation thing. Kachuk gets a pass on the wing. TJ blockers it aside. Can we stretch this to a six-game win streak? We're going to need to tie it up here, guys. 40 seconds left. And we need some offense. I know we've been getting it done. I can't say much because I asked for offense. The GM answered, signed two massive players in terms of offensive capabilities. Another save. The rebound will come out to ADB, and that is game. GG, no re. It will not be a six-game winning streak. We've laid a few big hits, but I still feel like overall our ability to have a physical presence has been lackluster recently. I don't know if it's just pure coincidence, but simming from the calendar seems to increase your chance of not getting a meeting. Hey, yo, we got our first career shutout. We were in for that one. That is tremendous, which means we can get sponge now if we keep the 890. That's all we need is an 890 save percentage. Easier said than done, I suppose. Oh, no way. We don't even have to get it by the end of the season. We just, we just get it. Th thank you, coach. Thank you so much. Now, which one should I use as an X factor and which one should I use as an ability? Let's see. So this, the exceptional, oh, no, I started to read the journey begins. And then as soon as I said the, I just switched to the other one. I have no idea how I managed to do that. Exceptional at making redirect controlled saves and much more likely to attempt to cover the puck. Give me that. Give me that. Beautiful. Sponge and all or nothing. And then... We also have dialed in, will, we will at the end of the year. We are two thirds of the way through the season. We have a record of 32, 20 and four. So we're looking pretty good. We just unlocked a new ability, which is now our X factor. And if we go to the stat central, we can see what's going on here. Kane, 62 points. He is doing tremendous. Yep, yeah, second in the Pacific division, 68 points. Edmonton is playing phenomenal this year. Kane is a dash four, but 62 points in 56 games. Nate Mack has 59. Eichel with 51. William Carlson with 38. That's weird. I feel like he was on the third line. Goalies are doing okay. Much better than before. 25, 10, and 2 with three shutouts and a 907 for Robin Leonard. And then 7, 11, 2 for TJ. A shutout. Let's go. And an 896. We're getting there. We're getting there. We can apparently afford six perks. And I will be buying the permanent ones again. I don't really care for that too much. But I will take this. Passing goes down, but meh. Nice. We can buy a big gym. Which gives us endurance, agility, and rebound control. Plus, it's permanent. So, we will be purchasing that. And that's all we're going to do for now because that's pretty much all we can do. Well, I would say we stepped it up, honestly. Actually, you know what? I'm going to sim to our next start. I don't know why I would stay here. Let's go ahead and simulate till we start next. I'm going to skip past that for now. Okay, yeah. How do I set this dismiss and never show again? Because I want it to just kind of do it for me. Will that work? Maybe? Well, that didn't take long. We are in against the Carolina Hurricanes. So thank you guys so much for watching. Again, I hope you're enjoying the series. I will see you soon.